Networker Authentication Services, or AuthC, is new to Networker 9.0. It provides token-based authentication for NMC and CLI users. AuthC is a web-based application installed on each Networker server. It uses a local database and optionally an LDAP or Active Directory server for authentication. When a Networker Management Console server is installed, the user specifies the name of the Networker server that will authenticate access to the NMC server. Optionally, AuthC can be managed by a separate server for external authentication. During the installation wizard for NMC, authentication service information should be entered, such as the authentication host and port. Trust is required between each networker server and the server running AuthC. When AuthC is installed on the same host as networker, trust is established automatically. Otherwise, use the NSR auth trust command on the host where a user would be adding the trust. After creating new users, the administrator must configure the NMC server to enable access for both the local and external users. To set the level of access the user has to the NMC server, map the NMC roles to the users and groups. NMC roles define the activities that a user is authorized to perform. By default, NMC assigns all roles to the Networker Authentication Service Local Database Administrator. From within Networker Administrator's user groups, token-based authentications are defined by the new external roles attribute. With authorization enabled, administrators are validated to perform operations in NMC. Non-token-based authentications are defined by the user's attribute. In order to use token-based authentication with the CLI command and perform backup or recovery operations from a client, issue the NSR login command. Once authentication has succeeded, the user can perform operations such as save and recover until the token expires. By default, the time until a token expires is 8 hours.